Prince Harry and Meghan Markle and their children are to attend the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations but have been omitted from the Trooping the Colour Balcony appearance by the Queen. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex confirmed that they were excited and honoured to attend the commemorations for the monarch's milestone in June with their eldest child and his sister Lilibet. Vanity Fair royal editor Katie Nichol has since claimed the Queen had very little option in allowing them to attend. Asked if Meghan and Harry's behaviour is damaging, Ms Nichol told Piers Uncensored on Talk TV, it is damaging to the Crown. It absolutely is. I think the Queen had very little. Harry and Meghan made it clear they wanted to be over here, it is a family event as well. The Queen wants her family around her, this is probably going to be the final hurrah. But I think you'll find those Netflix crews are kept at some distance. I think the idea that they're going to be allowed to hijack this in any way, the focus needs to stay on the Queen. Unfortunately the Sussexes as always provide a detract. It is not known which elements of the four-day jubilee weekend Harry and Meghan could make an appearance at. A spokeswoman for the couple said, Prince Harry and Meghan, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are excited and honoured to attend the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations this June with their children. It will be the first time Harry and Meghan have brought their family to the UK since leaving for the US. Lily's first birthday falls during the Jubilee weekend on June 4 and she is yet to meet the Queen, the Prince of Wales, and other members of the family. The monarch's decision to only include royals carrying out official public duties was taken after careful consideration, Buckingham Palace said. The symbolic move by the Queen has been interpreted as a snub to Harry and Meghan, who quit the monarchy for a new life in the US two years ago, and to Andrew, who was cast out of the institution over his civil sexual assault case. On June 2, Trooping the Colour, the Sovereign's official birthday parade, will kick-start the four days of Jubilee festivities, with 18 members of the royal family set to gather on the famous frontage, with the Queen looking forward to the weekend of celebration. A palace spokesman said, after careful consideration, the Queen has decided this year's traditional Trooping the Colour balcony appearance on Thursday June 2 will be limited to Her Majesty and those members of the royal family who are currently undertaking official public duties on behalf of the Queen.